Okay, I've set this robot up, or the weight on this, this one for about 6.4 grams, and so this is simulating uh, moon gravity. And here we go. the moon gravity. talk a little bit about how I built this thing. Um, I don't know what you call this. I call it a horse trainer. It's like those trainers where they let a horse walk around a carousel. And so I made this mostly out of uh, uh, fishing pole 
sections and uh, it's pretty friction free so I don't have any bearings in there or anything I just have a smaller tube inside of a larger tube and down here I've got my encoder wheel and this is one of the first things I need to really replace it's it's fairly accurate but it's all hand painted and uh, they're all different sizes and I noticed that if I run 40 trials or 50 trials I get four or five that have the same top distance so I need a little more precise encoder wheel so I'm going to try to order one or get a 3D printed one or something and uh, it's there's the IR uh, sensor that reads the encoder wheel and on the top I've got this uh, slip ring provides the power to the servos so uh, without worrying about the wires twisting and stuff like that I got a counterweight back here it's just a big magnet and I slide it back and forth on this on this uh, paper clip and uh, I took the uh, the arm off my old crawling robot project so it's just two servos and Arduino Uno and that's it so works pretty good uh, I've got a few improvements that I want to make to it but mostly changing the software and uh, that's it